For a Fedora user, the choice between the GNOME and KDE Plasma desktop environments comes down to a preference for a modern, streamlined experience or a customizable, traditional one. Both are stable and well-supported, but they offer vastly different workflows and aesthetics. Fedora Workstation GNOME is the default and flagship desktop for Fedora Workstation, offering a clean and intuitive user experience. Design philosophy focused on minimalism and a distraction-free workflow. It uses a unique activities overview for managing windows and launching applications, which is a departure from a traditional desktop layout. User experience, designed to be functional out of the box with a cohesive and consistent feel. Customization is limited by default, but extensions can be used to add more features. For whom, ideal for users who want a simple, modern interface without much tinkering. It suits beginners and productivity-focused users who appreciate the developer's curated design. Stability. Many users find that GNOME feels more robust and unbreakable with fewer visual glitches compared to KDE, especially when not over-customized with extensions. Recent improvements. Fedora 43 features GNOME 49 with a refined UI, new apps, and a Wayland-only desktop session for better performance. Fedora KDE Plasma. KDE Plasma offers a highly flexible and customizable desktop that resembles a traditional Windows desktop. The KDE spin of Fedora uses this as its default desktop. Design philosophy, a traditional desktop experience with powerful and flexible features under the hood. The goal is to allow users to personalize every aspect of their system. User experience offers a massive number of configuration options from themes and widgets to window management rules. It's a power user's playground that allows for deep personalization. For whom? Best for experienced users and those who value full control over their desktop's appearance and functionality. It's a great choice for those migrating from Windows who want a familiar layout. Performance. Recent releases of KDE Plasma 6 are known for being lightweight and fast, though some users report more occasional visual glitches than GNOME. Recent improvements. The Fedora KDE Plasma Desktop Edition is now a flagship edition, incorporating the latest features of KDE Plasma 6, such as HDR calibration and UI polish. How to decide. The best way to choose is to try both. You can test them without installing by creating live USBs for Fedora Workstation GNOME and Fedora KDE Plasma Desktop. If you are new to Linux, Fedora Workstation with GNOME is an excellent starting point because it provides a reliable, ready-to-use desktop without overwhelming you with options. If you are switching from Windows or are a power user, Fedora KDE is a powerful choice that provides a familiar layout with a massive degree of customization. Your choice isn't permanent. You can switch desktop environments at any time on an existing Fedora installation. However, it's generally recommended to install them on separate Fedora instances to avoid potential conflicts and visual clutter.